In the past few years, China's space program has been very much in the international media spotlight. Of course, it is the astronauts who become the celebrities. But behind the scenes, a successful rocket launch involves a thousand of highly qualified scientists and technicians. In China, the rocket scientists of the future are receiving their practical training at the Beijing University of Aeronautics and Astronautics. On November the 1st, 2006, a successful launch took place at the Jiuquan Satellite Launch Center. A rocket was sent into orbit, called the Beijing University of Aeronautics and Astronautics No. 1. The rocket was the first in China to be designed and made entirely by graduate students. The media described the project's success as a spectacular achievement. Li Wei, a leading computer scientist in China, born on June 8, 1943. He's the vice chancellor of Beijing University of Aeronautics and Astronautics since January 2002. In the laboratory at the Beijing University of Aeronautics and Astronautics, a group of second-year students are making an aeroplane. The laboratory was built in 2002, since when every graduate of the university has at one time or another worked there. Although most of the work can be done in the laboratory, there's only one way to make sure that the plane reaches the required technical standard, that is by flying it. It is the dream of most of the students who come to the university to make their own plane during their four years there. In November 2006, the university established the country's first course in airplane manufacture. On the afternoon of June 7, 2007, a ceremony was held at the university's senior engineering institute to welcome a number of new tutors. From then on, every second-year student would have a personal tutor. Mean 
，所以我们才要设立这个导师日，通过导师来单独对这些这些学生，这个根据每根据每一个人的特点来进行，就来进行不断的提高他们在这些方面的素质。When the university first introduced the tutorial system for undergraduates in 2002, it created quite a stir. It was considered unconventional, since previously only graduate students had been given tutors. So, most teachers are supporting. But there are some teachers who are now because we are a university university. We are a university university. We are a university u n i v e r For the time being, however, only the second-year students at the Senior Engineering Institute have personal tutors. At the other two institutes, three or four students share a tutor. Another advantage of the new system is that it allows students to assist the postgraduate students with their research projects. We want 17 students. Now, there are three students who have started studying. We want to continue to expand. From the year one, there are teachers who are concerned about their students. Besides learning the skills, they also learn the skills. 这样呢，实行导师制以后，这个才能够更加把这个因材施教落到实处。